I won't stop asking for justice until justice is found. The wife of Haiti's slain president, Jovenel Moise, has made a direct plea to the international community to help find his killers. In an interview with Reuters, Martine Moise said she was determined to get justice for her husband, who was gunned down in a late-night raid by suspected mercenaries at the couple's home in July. Moise's murder plunged the Caribbean nation, already plagued by hunger and gang violence, further into chaos and triggered a hunt for the masterminds across the Americas. Every country that can help, please help, because the people that did that are still out there. And I don't know if their name will ever be out. Nearly two months on from the assassination, certain aspects of the murder remain shrouded in mystery. Haitian police have arrested more than three dozen suspects, including 18 Colombian mercenaries, an obscure Haitian-American doctor they say aspired to be president, and the head of Moyes' security team. But they have made public little in the way of evidence, and one judge investigating the case has stepped down, citing security concerns. The former first lady says she's losing faith in the process and hopes the FBI will be able to help. I'm asking myself, will they ever find the people that really have to be found? Because those people, they did, they did it, but uh, someone gave the orders, someone paid the money. Haiti is now reeling from another crisis, a devastating earthquake that struck last month, killing at least 2,000 people. Elections initially slated for September have been postponed until November, and some have speculated they could be delayed further. Martin Moyes called on the Prime Minister to hold the vote as soon as possible to ensure stability. She also confirmed to Reuters her previous comments about wanting a political career herself. She said she would not let her husband's vision die with him.